A local surfing champion is back home after breaking a big record in China. She was the first woman to ride the waves at the Silver Dragon competition. KCAL 9's Juan Fernandez caught up with Mary Osborne near her Ventura hometown. I still kind of trip out a little bit when I say I'm a professional surfer. If there's one thing Mary Osborne is good at, it's surfing. Whether on the longboard or tandem, she's a pro. I don't know if you ever really know if you're good at surfing, but uh, my first sponsor uh, was about 15, 16 years old, and I started competing up and down the California coast and winning a lot of contests, and that just kind of opened the door for you know my career as a professional surfer. Osborne lives in Ventura, but she's been around the world competing with the best surfers. Most recently, she was the first woman ever invited to Hangzhou, China, near Shanghai, to surf a massive river wave that only happens when the sun, the moon, and the earth are in perfect alignment. The wave itself is bizarre because you really don't know what it's going to do. I mean, you're looking out miles up this river and seeing this, what you think is a wave. You really don't know. And out of the blue comes this giant wall of white water, and it changes dramatically throughout the time that you're on it. Osborne's career has included co-authoring a woman's guide to surfing, running a surf camp for girls, as well as time in front of the camera as a surf model. These days, modeling has taken a backseat to the busy schedule she keeps, riding the waves and doing what she loves most. Being a female, they, they really wanted to have a ballerina, not a professional surfer, so I took a while to ease them into it, but now they're pretty proud. So where is Osborne headed next? My career is never ending. <laughs> Just when I think I'm done, there's a whole nother project. Osborne tells me she originally wanted to become a broadcaster before dropping out of college in her junior year. She says she's never looked back. In Ventura, I'm Juan Fernandez, KCAL 9 News. Yeah. She is so talented. Gnarly. Mm -hmm. I always yeah. wanted to learn how to surf. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I tried it once, I almost drowned. Right. That's because I had a big, huge that's, hat on. That's a good sign you're not a surfer. Not a surfer. Yeah, big hat. hats don't work. Who wears no. a hat when they surf? It, it, <laughs> by the way, those big hats, I'm told they draw sharks. I do.